The 2016 Toyota Mirai is the first ever production fuel cell car offered for sale by a major car maker. Hi, I'm John Volker from Green Car Reports and this is the 2016 Toyota Mirai fuel cell vehicle. The Mirai goes on sale in Japan next month and will arrive in North America in the second half of next year. The four-seat midsize sedan is effectively an electric car with a 153 horsepower motor that powers its front wheels. But instead of storing electricity in a large battery pack, the owner refills the car's reinforced high-pressure storage tanks with hydrogen gas, which the car then converts into electricity in a fuel cell. The big advantage of fuel cell cars is their ability to refuel in five minutes or less and gain about 300 miles of range, something electric cars can't currently do, even with the highest power DC fast charging. Toyota has been very clear on two points. First, it doesn't believe that electric cars have a future as family vehicles, meaning mid-size sedans and crossovers and larger vehicles beyond that. Second, Toyota sees the Mirai, which means future in Japanese, as establishing a new and transformative powertrain technology for the new century, just as the Prius did about 20 years ago. The styling of the Mirai is, to put it politely, polarizing. That's pretty similar to the Prius too. Toyota says the lines are meant to evoke the process of taking air from the atmosphere in through the front of the car and converting it into the clean water vapor that is the car's only exhaust. There are four seats inside to avoid any penalty in weight or performance from a fifth occupant. We've driven the Mirai, and it's essentially like an electric car with a few extra noises. Compressor and injector noise from some of the plumbing that moves the hydrogen around the car and through the fuel cell. If we had to sum up the experience of driving the Mirai, it would be kind of like a Prius, but quieter. The big challenge for fuel cell vehicles, of course, is the present lack of hydrogen fueling stations. Toyota and Honda are both loaning money to third-party fuel providers to establish the first of what's projected to be ultimately a network of 100 hydrogen stations in California. That's enough to support more than 10,000 hydrogen vehicles, but it points to the slow pace of growth for this latest clean vehicle technology. Nonetheless, Toyota firmly believes that hydrogen is the right solution for zero emission vehicles. Toyota's built the car, and while buyers may take it for granted that it has all the traditional virtues of a Toyota, they're probably gonna to wanna to know where they can fuel the car and how far they can take it on road trips. On that one, stay tuned. I'm John Volker for Green Car Reports. We'll give you all the news on the 2016 Toyota Mirai fuel cell vehicle as it happens.